Assalamu alaikum, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Before we start, just know that there is a rumor floating around that Kyrie Irving has supposedly accepted Islam, which is making him the reason he's missing some games. I haven't covered this just because uh, there is no confirmation of this. Like, how do you know this? Has he openly come out and said this? Like, is there some type of source that I don't know about? Is this an inside source or whatever? But there's a rumor floating around. So remember, as Muslims, we don't just believe rumors. We got to have the actual proof and evidence. So if there is someone who knows something detailed or something insider, do let me know or drop it in the comment section below but what i'm about to talk about right now is fact and is truth about what happened on twitter last night recently nba champion and superstar kyrie irving has been making a lot of noise in the muslim world and on twitter for his pro-islamic tweets from quoting verses of the holy quran to thanking allah live on tv grateful always to allah god for allowing me to come out here so I'm just grateful. It seems as if Kyrie Irving has taken a keen interest in Islam. Alongside this viral picture in which Kyrie looks like he's doing some type of Salah position, can't be sure. But last night, Ramadan Kyrie was trending on Twitter. With a series of moves torching the 76ers for 37 points last night, Allah used Kyrie's clout to make Islam trend on Twitter. Because Kyrie Irving is a household name, the word association in Ramadan has now also officially become a household name. We know that Islam will be so successful that it will enter every single household. And last night is a perfect example of how quickly Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala can do that just by using Twitter. And I pray that we as Muslims are seeing this as an example to take our Ramadans more seriously too. Because in the holy month of Ramadan, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala closes the gates of hellfire and locks up the shayateen alongside with opening the gates of paradise to make his mercy and forgiveness more accessible. If the devils are locked up in Ramadan, then why do I still do bad in Ramadan, smart guy? Now the devils might be locked up, but your nafs and desire is not. Plus, for 11 straight months shaitan was conditioning you putting you on autopilot so that when he takes that vacation for that one month in the holy month of ramadan you are on autopilot continuing his work but remember this one month of ramadan with sincere actions and intentions can change your life forever and help you build better habits i love it so on April 25th, I will be traveling to Barclays Center to personally try and give Kyrie Irving a Quran and officially invite him to Islam. So please make dua for me and stay tuned for that video. And until next time, I'm out.